Thanksgiving's coming up on Friday, and you're probably going to be taking a ton of pictures of your kids. Some will be cute, some will be adorable, and some just might turn out to be plain awkward. Now, if that happens, don't delete them. Send them to the guys at Awkward Family Photos. You know who they are. They just published several books filled with hilariously uncomfortable photos. And their website, awkwardfamilyphotos.com, gets millions of hits every single day. We teamed up with them, and they've sent us some very exclusive, very awkward photos just in time for Halloween. So let's take a look. Here's dad posing with his kids. <laughs> I don't want to say this dad has a favorite, but he might. <laughs> Here's a family that dressed up as Goldilocks and the Three Bears. I'm not sure if they quite got the parts right. And what could be cuter than a granddad posing with one of his grandchildren on Halloween? <laughs> I'm not sure what's going on in this next photo. I think it's a Halloween photo. I hope it's a Halloween photo. <laughs> you know there has to be a good story behind that photo. Now, it's been almost 40 years since they posed for that picture, but guess what? They are all here today. <laughs> Please welcome the Lapham family, Reg, Ross, Roger, and Marge. Yeah. Come on up here. Come on Hi. up here. Hi, Hi Marge. Nice to meet you. Hey, fellas. Hey, hey. Hi. I Hi. like y'all. Y'all girthy. Yeah. <laughs> Get girth. What is the story behind that photo? Well, my son, Reg, who is also a very sweet young man that never, never does anything bad, we went to a particular <laughs> uh, place to have our picture made for Christmas, mm -hmm. and he wouldn't take off his mask, so we thought we'd humor him so that when he got there, maybe they would socially make him feel embarrassed and he'd take the mask off. Well, you know what? No, with the H. And I was sitting there all, <laughs> with the all dressed up, and he wouldn't take it off, and that's what happened. I mean, we just, all these years, we still don't understand why in the heck he didn't take that mask off. <laughs> it's like one of these kids is doing his own thing. Reg, yes, what do you absolutely. remember about taking that picture? I just didn't want to take that mask off. What's with the mask, man? Halloween should not, not be just one day a week or a month <laughs> or a year. It should be every day. Ross, is this surprising? Is this your brother? It all really the time? doesn't surprise me because uh, growing up, we went trick or treating all year round. July was our favorite month to trick or treat. Oh, you are serious about this? We didn't always get we didn't always get candy, but we got a lot of food. You can tell tuna sandwiches, crackers, tuna sandwiches. Oh my God. Yeah. So you would just get dressed up and go around the neighborhood oh, and ring yeah, people's yeah, bells and say own, trick absolutely. or treat. <laughs> And well, come home with a tuna sandwich. <laughs> yeah. well, I was saying that. Pretty ingenious. We were divorced. And right. they were, you know, they were saying that poor Marge. She just didn't feed her boys big enough. Well, look here. <laughs> they figured it out. They figured, yeah. they figured it out. I think it's so funny. Well, I, I, I tell you what, I would love it if you would recreate that infamous picture mm. of 40 oh, years my. ago. You, oh, th my. you think you'd be up for it? Sure. Okay, we'll do it. <sighs> okay, well, that's so nice to you, Roger. Thank you. We're gonna need one thing in order to pull this off. Uh oh. Uh oh. We need ah! the mask. We found it. No way. <laughs> yes, 